Hi, I'm Joe Creek, the Holistic Health Coach. Today I'm going to get you toned in eight and we're going to work the core and we're going to be doing a pike. Okay, so you don't need any kit for this, all right? So there's three options. First option, on the arms and on the knees. Okay, we're going to keep the back straight. We're going to draw the waist in. So try and align the spine so the head, the top of the back and the bum is in a straight line. And I'm just going to gently push my bum into the air as I draw my waist in and then back down. Or we can do the same movement on the toes. So draw the waist in, keep the back straight, up smooth, and then down. Or the hardest option is on the arms as well. So draw the waist in, so it's on the hands. Up smooth, and then down smooth. Okay, so let's get ready to go. So remember, you've got three rounds of work. There's 40 reps in each round. The first round, get nice and warm, and then you can try and step the exercise up. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the easiest option first. So I'm gonna have my knees, hip width, down onto my arms. I'm gonna draw my waist in, so my head, top of the back and the bum is a straight line. Okay, let's go. Up smooth, down. So nice and easy. So as you push the bum up in the air, draw the waist in. Okay, two more. Okay, now I'm gonna speed up. So three, two, one, and then drop. So remember, as you're lifting the bum up, allow the waist to draw in. So feel the abdominals drawing in, so the waist is going in towards the spine. You will fit it on the arms as well a little bit. Okay, one more, and then we'll speed change again. So let's come up quick, and then slowly down. Three. Remember, this is the easiest option that I'm doing. The next round, I'm gonna step it up. If it feels too tough, you can always drop back to this one. Two more. Okay, 10 reps. One, two, two more. Okay, and relax. That's round one done. We've got two more rounds left. You've got half a minute rest. Okay. So now I'm going to step it up to the next option. So I'm going to stay on my arms, but now I'm going to go onto my toes. So I'm going to keep the back straight. If it gets tough, I can always drop down onto my knees again. Okay, so make sure you've aligned the spine so the head, the top of the back and the bum is in a straight line. So back straight, draw the waist in. Okay, here we go, three, two, one, up, down. Three, so smooth and slow, controlled. So I keep trying to draw the waist in. So keep the belly in towards the spine. One more. Okay, speed change. One. 
two, slow on the way up, drop from the top. Two more. Okay, speed change up quick and slowly down. Three. So slow and controlled on the way back. Eight, two more. Okay, now 10 reps to the end. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Okay, relax. Oh, that's tough, right? Okay, we've got half a minute rest. Get ready for round number three. So remember, you've got three options. Go onto the arms as well if you want, or onto the hands, knees or toes. Okay, get ready to go in ten. So I'm going to try and attempt a few on the hands. My arm straight. Here we go. Up. Up smooth. So as you come down, make sure you try and keep the back straight. Allow that belly to draw in as you lift the bum. One more. Three and one. There you go, that's tough. Four. Feel the arms as well. Six, four, two more, nine, up, hold, and slowly down. Four. This is going to work the core. Six. Four more. One more. Okay, now ten reps. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and relax. Oh, feel the core. That's tough. Okay, so let me know how it felt. Let me know if you completed all three rounds, and I'll see you for next time.